Well, this is so much fun. I, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna have to tell you guys. This is my favorite slime. This is my favorite slime. Hi, Ride Play Pals. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're new to our channel, click that red subscribe button, ring that notification bell so you get updates anytime we upload new videos. So guys, let me tell you what we're doing today. We are doing an unboxing of some super cool slime. We've done some slime in the past. We did do some slime from the Compound Kings. And so today we're going to do some more. We're gonna do the mix and mash, squishy like slime alpha. And then we're also going to do avalanche, which seems pretty cool. So I think we should start first with the alpha. And we're gonna go ahead and take this out of the packaging and let's see what's inside. I love the color of this in terms of the nice little purple. And so we're gonna see what this is like in the past, let me tell you. I love the Compound Kings and their squishy like slime because I think the consistency is really, really cool. So we've got some nice little letters right there that we're gonna put inside that's gonna add to some crunch and some texture um, to our compound that we have right here. Oh my goodness, guys. Already I can tell this is going to be something that I'm gonna like and I hope you guys will as well. So let's go ahead and get to playing with our slime. We're gonna just take it out. Ooh, it just fell right out of the package, guys. That was really, really cool. I love how this is kind of a pink, like purple. I don't know if you guys can tell. Oh, it feels so good. It feels so relaxing. Oh my goodness. Very, very relaxing, guys. This is nice. I don't know if you can hear the sound. It makes a little popping sound a little bit. And then let's see if we can do a little poke. We can do a little bit of poke here and there. So that is cool. And it stretches really well, look. Hoo wee, you can, man, you can see right through it. This is so cool. So I got these at Walmart. I actually got them around the holidays. So that's how long I've had it, guys. Um, for those of you who follow my channel, you know that I have so many toys. I could probably not buy another toy for the next, I don't know, couple of months and probably do a video every day. <laughs> this slime is so cool. And um, I love saving the packaging. And in the future, I may do a video where I take my old slime out of the packages to see how well they, they stood the test of time. But um, inside the package right here, there are two of these little packages and it's gonna add some texture to our slime. So let's go ahead and put that in there. So we're gonna add the second one. Oh my goodness. I love the sound of that. Look guys. Oh my goodness, look. Nice. Nice guys. This slime is awesome. Oh my goodness. I really, really, really love the texture of this. The little alphabet cubes inside feel really, really good on your hands. Like when you squeeze it, it's like a little mini massage. So it feels really, really good. So for those of you who like playing with slime because you like the feel of it, I think you will love this because I do. I love it. You guys let me know in the comments below if you've ever had this slime. And if you do, let me know what you think about it. Okay guys, so we're gonna go to our next one that we have right here, the Avalanche, which is really, really cool. And I think this is gonna be a nice little texture um, for us to play with. Excited about being able to do this. Now the other slime that I did do, it was um, Naughty and the Nice slime that I did during the holidays. It came in a similar container like this. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh. I wasn't expecting that. I don't know what I was expecting. Um, so I've got some of these little balls like going everywhere. So I'm gonna try to keep these here so it doesn't roll out too much. I don't know. Oh gosh, guys. Oh. I'm about to make a huge mess. But sometimes messes are lots and lots and lots of fun. Okay, so we let's get these, oh goodness. So we gotta get these little foam balls out. And they're so pretty, I love the pink of them. And 
down in the bottom. Let's see how we get this out. Oh goodness. So it's got a little like plastic piece in here. I don't know if you can see it, but you kind of have to pull this little plastic top out. It, it sits down on top and separates the little foam from the actual slime. And the slime here is like a glittery slime and it's coming out pretty easy. And that's one of the things that I like about the Compound Kings. It just pretty much comes out. Now I did have a little bit that stuck down in there, but it came out pretty easy. So there we go. This is our slime right here, guys. Our glitter slime. I love that. It almost looks like the slime that I made, just the, it's a different color. I'll insert a card above so you guys can check out the slime that I made myself. It is a darker pink, more of a fuchsia type pink, but I made a similar one myself. And so now what we're going to do is we are going to um, put the nice little foam balls in it. Now the only thing that I wish is I wish the slime was on top in the container and then like they had the foam balls at the bottom and then the slime at the top. So I could take my slime out first and then I could kind of pour my little foam balls um, onto it in order to make like a, a crunchy like slime. So the whole purpose with this is to make a crunchy slime. And I'm trying not to get foam balls everywhere here in the studio. Ah, I think I lost one. So probably more than one. They're like rolling. And so I'm trying to get these on. So you guys, this is a little bit of a mess. Not not a bad mess though. They're just rolling a little bit and flying on the floor and things like that. So I'm trying to get them all. But I think it feels really, really good. I love the textured slime and this is awesome. It feels so good. The sounds it's making, I can hear some really cool sounds, but I'm making a mess. I'm making a mess. I'm making a mess. This is definitely not one for very, very small kids. So if you have little brothers or sisters, you want to keep this away from them because you don't want them to eat these because this would look like candy to them. It's not candy. It's not candy. So, um, but I'm getting as much of the foam balls on here as I can. So in the future, if I were to do this, I would probably put the foam balls in a container first. Oh my gosh, this feels so good. This feels good. Oh, this feels so good. Oh, this feels so good. It feels good. Oh goodness, this feels so good, guys. Oh. I'm just amazed at how good this feels. Now I know why people like really get into slime and playing with slime. Did you see that like random ball just go doop, 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 foam ball? Anyway, I got foam balls probably on the floor, I'm sure. I've got some here under the camera, but we're not gonna worry about it. We got most of them. Oh, a random one just flew off the edge. Woo, you gotta make sure I guess that they're worked in really well because they're popping out. They're popping out, guys. They're popping. Oh, this is so much fun. I, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna have to tell you guys. This is my favorite slime. This is my favorite slime ever. And there's something to be said about having the foam and the crunchiness of it and how it feels, especially when it goes between your fingers and stuff. It feels so good. It feels good. So you guys let me know, have you ever made crunchy slime? If you haven't, you might want to make it. I'm going to try to make my own because I love this so much. They make some good, good compound that squishy like slime. It's really, really cool. And I love now that I have some that I can kind of mix and match and put other stuff inside. So I think it is so cool and I'm looking forward to being able to do more. So I'm going to take this when I'm done with it and I am going to put it in a container because I want to play with it some more later. Um, but guys, that's all we had today on Instant Ride Play. But before we go, I just wanted to say, even if you have a hard day, we hope you find some time to play and we'll see you next time on Instant Ride Play.